Oh, okay, I can just talk. Hi guys, it's week two of level two Cha Cha. Um, I am injured today, so John Mark is going to be following um, while Jonathan explains the patterns that we went over today. Uh, so the one of the first ones we did was their locks, the mirror form backward here. So we forgot to do it on Mark's back. So we're going to do a basic first. We're going to go two, three, four, and one. Two, three, four, and one. Four, and one. Four, and one. Right, two, three, four, and one. Four, and one. Four, and one. Two, three. So leaders, after this back break, it's a great time to start this. Two, three. I over rotate to get her easier to lock. Four, and one. My body drive is to keep on progressing. Four and one, four and one. We're gonna break. Two, three, come back. Four and one, four and one, four and one, two, three. Remembering for leaders and followers, don't allow the elbows to go behind you. You lost all connection now. All right? What's happening in leaders and followers are pulling and also pushing when you're leading this pattern, okay? Uh, our first one's up. Yeah, that's good. Ah. Now we're going to chop to the left and right. We're going to do a side. We're going to go two, three, four, and one. Do a back right. Two, three. Start this. Four and one. Four and one. Four and one. Break. Two, three, four and one. Four and one. Four and one. Break. Two, three. So the rules for this one that apply as you do the back break leaders. Two. Three, we're square. Four and one, we're square. To lead this, Lears, have a strong left foot connection and really turn it. Four and one. At this point, we're not back to back. We're at a 45 degree angle. Keep your weight moving. We're out. Then we rotate. Four and one. Square and upper partner again. Break. Two, three. Up. Coming back. Square. Four and one. Open out. Four and one, square. Four and one, break, two, three. Remember not to step outside of your guys' shoulders box. Don't go too big, but it makes it a lot harder. Keep it roughly short with part. Allows you a quicker transition and get more hip movement for the pattern. We also taught underarm turns left and right. Here we go. Two, three, four, and one. Two. Three, four, and one. Two, three, four, and stop. So what's happening right here, leaders, is going to take this break to your left. I want my body to rotate out with the partner as I turn. If I take a step straight back as I do this, it get a lot more connection away from me. It's going to pull on the connection. So when I take this, I start rotating out as I turn the follower. What the follower is doing is that she takes this turn, four and one, two. Her right foot, as oh there, is a fulcrum. It's staying still, it's not moving. She's rotating back onto it and going to the side. Four and one. Square up, make sure her connection stays down at her core after the turn. On her turn to the right now, same thing. Turn, two, forwards, keep your left foot here now in place. Come back to the side. Four and one, back down at her core. One more time. Two, three, four and one. Two, three, four and one. Two, three, four and stop. Show the other side. So we got two, three, four and one. Two, three, four and one. Two, three, four and stop. And that's pretty much all we did today. Thank you guys so much for coming. We'll see you guys next time.